My name is Wade Henderson, championroper.com. I am here with the champion healer of the DFI, Mr. Randon Adams, sir. I love the horse that you're riding. Can you tell me a little bit about him? Uh, you know, I've had him for about nine years. He's 14 this year. He, his name's Diesel. I've, he's made everything for me, you know. I bought him when he was real young from a kid up here in Oklahoma, Dusty Drake. And, you know, he's one of the nicest horses, the nicest horse I've ever rode. And, He's been turned out for nine months, ain't been rode since February. I run eight steers on him the last two days and ride him up here, and he he makes it easy, you know. And, and all, you gotta, all you gotta do is sit up there and try and rope. And it, it don't happen like that all the time. Oh, let me tell you something, you know how to rope. Now, folks right here is a past world champion healer. Now, you don't have to tell about, you know, a horse lets you rope. You know how to rope very well. And you have another horse, buckskin horse. He's a stud horse. Can you tell me a little bit about him? Uh, yeah, we got a breeding operation, cutting horses and rope horses. Uh, we raised him. I own his mom and his dad and uh, broke him since a two-year-old and just kind of rode him everywhere. He's eight this year. And He's awesome. I rode him at Salinas. I just gave Diesel some time off when I quit rodeo. I quit rodeo on two years ago. I go eight to ten rodeos a year and hardly ever jackpot. And I was out here for the U.S. finals and wasn't entered. Found out I was entered two days ago and talked me into coming up here. It wasn't bad. Now, you know, 25,000 added here and, you know, hardly anybody knows about this roping. You know, is this going to, you know, hopefully this roping gets bigger and bigger and bigger. I mean, are you going to try to come back next year to this thing? Oh, yeah. It depends on, yeah, I'm going to try and come back as much as I can if I can get away from work. But, uh, <laughs> it, it's this is a good rope, you know. It's heard about more than you think. You know what I'm saying? The first couple of years they started it, some people knew about it. Now everybody talks about it. I mean, this is one of the best the best rope of the week. And then you go to the U.S. final, paid good. I mean, I think we won over 7,500 or something. I mean, a day's worth of work. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that beats working all day, then don't it? Yes, sir, it does. And it's a great rope. And I mean, this is my first time to it, and we had fun. And I rope with Ty Blast again with Spencer Mitchell. And, just got tied last night, we ended up doing good. And that's what he said, he called and wanted to know if you wanted to win some money, you're gonna enter up. <laughs> yeah, we ended up entering, and I roped with Ty quite a bit before, and he ropes great, he did a great job for me today, and I got lucky and caught something. I know I was talking to Ty earlier, and he said, you know, I told him, I said, usually, you know, he run to the hip this time, usually he drops three coils, and he said, well, my healer never wastes no time when I got him turned. Oh no, he's one of the, one of them reachers, you know, and he jackpots good too, you know. He, he's got both games, and that's a big thing. A lot of these headers someday, he's got to be one of the top headers, so he, he does a great job. I mean, you know, if even if you got a faster, you got a chance to win with it because you can throw his rope so far. Yes, sir. I appreciate your time and congratulations again, folks. If you ever hear Randon Adams' name called anywhere, team roping, jackpot, rodeo, whatever, kids get to the fence. Watch this gentleman right here rope feet because you will not be disappointed. I'm Wade Henderson with ChampionRoper.com.